The Pacific Palisades of Southern California is famous for its picturesque beauty. Nestled in the hills above the beaches of Malibu, it's home to countless celebrities. It's also one of Los Angeles County's crappiest neighborhoods. Not because of the quality of the housing or the schools, both of which are excellent here, but because of the sheer volume of dog excrement found along its sidewalks. It's everywhere you look, a proverbial boatload of canine feces littering the lawns. Specimens may vary in size and composition, but all contribute to the sickening stench that wafts in the breeze. This one block stretch of Sunset Boulevard alone yielded over 60 samples in a single collection. And with so many posted reminders and numerous products designed to facilitate cleanup, the question arises, why would someone who lives in such a beautiful and expensive area allow their pets to leave behind such a quantity of disease spreading filth? Maybe they think it's a natural recycling of organic material, like dust to dust. Or, more likely, maybe they think it's someone else's job to pick it up. Or, maybe they're hoping it will somehow just wash itself away. But perhaps there's a benefit to all this neglect. One that you might not think of in a million years. Or even 60 million years. What an interesting fossil it is! And it is a fossil! And there's even a name for it! Yes, this is a coprolite. Oh, beautiful two-part science word. Another science word, copra light. Light means lithos, stone. And copris means poo poo doo doo. Yeah, this is dinosaur poopy, and you touched it. Artifacts such as seeds, bones, and fish scales can be preserved within ancient feces, indicating both the animal's diet and the climate in which it lived. So, just as the tar pits of La Brea reveal the secrets of our distant past, the coprolite fields of Sunset Boulevard will provide invaluable information about our environment, as well as our animal domestication practices. Like thousands of repugnant time capsules, they will provide the physical evidence needed for future generations of archaeologists to follow in our footsteps. Let's just hope they wipe their feet before going in the house. <laughs>